Do you feel very challenging to meditate? Then this video is for you. I personally get lot of thoughts. My mind and brain is always active. It's always been a challenge. But when I figured out which meditation style works for me, things have become easier. There are two different types of meditation. You need to figure out which meditation style works for you, which meditation does not. Focus on which works. Improvise on which does not slowly, and things will start falling in place. So before I start revealing you what are the two meditation styles and what are the simplest ways you can get started meditating, please hit the subscribe button, hit the bell icon so that you are notified about our future videos on abundance manifestation for health financial relationships hitting the subscribe button might be free for you but it's very valuable for us because it will help us to take our mission forward for helping people lead abundant lifestyle like one size does not fit for all one meditation does not fit for all one process does not fit for all you need to experience experiment and go through certain processes to get the outcome and understanding which works for you famous people practice meditation daily like oprah winfrey sundar pichai ceo of google deepika padukon amita bachchan arjun rampal anupam kher kangana rawat shilpa shetty juhi chawla these are some famous personality who practice meditation and they recommend as well practicing meditation so if such personalities recommend and practice in their daily life isn't it important for you also to practice so that you also get such benefits if you want to get benefits like them stay tuned in this video till the end now the question comes why does practicing meditation even matter the answer is simplified in a funny way because google does not have answers to all your questions <laughs> so let's take example of a car if the, you are having a car or a bike if you do not service it will get rust and it will break down or even if the fuel is finishing if you keep driving the car thinking i do not have time to fuel my car i need to reach my destination you keep driving you keep driving the petrol pumps keeps on passing off the gas stations keep on passing off at certain moment the petrol finishes the fuel finishes in your vehicle the vehicle stops there are no gas stations around so what was logically to be done when you found the gas station go and fuel your vehicle similarly healing meditation and spiritual practices are like fuel for the vehicle your body for the soul to unleash its true potential for the god the higher power to descend in your system to unlock the true potential through which you can start manifesting your health goals financial goals relationship goals in easier faster and effective manner these are actually by products of meditation the main essence is you connect with your true essence with your true power when you connect with your true power automatically things will start falling in place that's why it's important to practice meditation if you want to experience the unleashing of your true potential to manifest your goals faster let's take one more example if there was a government approved scheme which says invest 1000 rupees and you are given 23000 rupees in return isn't that amazing deal you should go blindly and invest investing 1000 rupees and you get 23000 rupees in return isn't that crazy similarly the god the supreme almighty universe has designed our life in such a way that invest 1 hour in yourself you are blessed with 23 hours of beautiful lifestyle if not 1 hour can you start with half an hour if not half an hour you can you at least start with 15 minutes i know current busy lifestyle people say bhai hamare paas saans lene ka bhi time nahi hai are you one of them or you heard people saying that i totally agree because of stress and situations work deadlines family responsibility it's hard to take out some valuable time but I am sure you can some way adjust wake up 5 minutes early sleep 5 minutes late you can at, le at least adjust with practicing 5 minutes meditation daily increment by 1 minute daily slowly slowly your meditation duration increases then you will connect with your deeper self faster why doing meditation is important let me repeat it's for your benefit to have more management skills in your life to manifest results faster like there is a saying i don't know how much true is it mahatma gandhi used to do meditation or chant some mantras about 1 hour daily one fine day he said 
today i'm so busy i cannot meditate for one hour i need to do meditation for two hours what does that mean meditation or healing or spiritual practices does not take away time from your life they are instead making you more productive more focused the number of hours it might take 10 20 hours maybe you can do the same work in few hours by being more productive more focused with more ideas generating more clarity more concentration and many more benefits that's why it's very important to practice meditation have you been practicing meditation or already or you tried some way but it did not work pause this video and share in the comments what have you been practicing what did not work for you also share in the comments which type of meditation you have been practicing so irrespective of which your country you are from from india nepal japan china pakistan usa australia meditation is universal it will work for every human being some people say it does not work for me but maybe you did not try the right way there are different types of meditations available different definitions of meditations existing let's understand one simplified definition let me read out for you meditation is a powerful practice that will bring you in a peace reduce stress improve your overall well being in this video we will show you how to do meditation properly to achieve the best results so whether you are a complete novice or someone looking to refine your meditation practice this guide is totally for you let's redefine let's understand the meditation again and what's the intention you need to have what's the definition of clarity you need to have related to meditation meditation is a practice that involves focusing your mind on a particular object thought or activity to train attention and awareness ultimately achieving a mentally clear and emotionally calm state there are some common myths about meditation we need to understand before entering into the journey one You need to be a very spiritual person. Let go of everything we detached. Then you practice meditation. No, meditation is for every common human being who wants to excel in their life and manifest more results. Second, you need to empty your mind. Emptying mind is always not possible because you get many thoughts automatically. Meditation is process towards the journey of emptying your mind that you can say so. Third, it will come instantly as soon as you try. Let me break this myth now itself if you are expecting you watch this video and sit in meditation you will be immediately enlightened with the meditation talent no it's not going to happen it will take consistent time effort and practice to gain certain state meditation for is for old or retired people many people say no i am busy right now let me focus on career when i become old let me practice meditation no meditation is not only for old or retired people meditation is for especially for youngsters or working professionals or business owners do you want to grow in your career faster do you want to excel in your studies or you want to get more financial outcomes or business to grow multifold if then meditation is for you to get such results because it will help you to be more productive focused clear calm more creative then the main myth there is no time to meditate there are simple and easy techniques that you can do while walking as well stay tuned in this video maybe i'll share it to you if i don't share ask me in the comments maybe i'll create one more video for that now let's understand the fundamentals how to establish and experience the meditation aspect first of all you need to find a calm cozy place where no one disturbs you or no much sounds are disturbing you then sit in a posture make a habit of fixing a place and repeatedly doing there and our brain will anchor that place as if whenever you go there it's time for meditation so let's easily drift into that so first comes about sitting posture you need to sit straight with your spine and find your cog center of gravity it's one more topic of explanation watch our video on how to awaken your channels and nadis in that we explain you how to find out your center of gravity point with which you can immediately get into the calm state blissful state because of which universal energies will pass through your system half of the meditation accomplishment happens by finding your cog so make sure you watch that video to find out your cog point now comes the deep breathing close your eyes and take deep inhalation and deep exhalation you can add on the breathing process as you inhale 
feel the belly going out as you exhale feel the belly going in and let the exhalation go out from your mouth also you can feel with inhalation relaxation across your body is spreading and as you exhale out through your mouth some stress or heaviness or tightness is being released out of your system and you are getting free making your body comfortable before starting any meditation is very very important just directly jumping in the process is not much effective so preparation is always best this is the best way to prepare now comes the time to choose the meditation technique it's very very important for you to find out what meditation style works for you there are two types of meditation one is passive meditation second is active meditation let's understand about the first one what is passive meditation so passive meditation is the one where you sit with eyes closed without much of body movements without any visualizations or much of intentions you just focus on your breath and the point is to bring the awareness as much as possible towards your breath and calm your mind one of the ways is the mindfulness meditation where you close your eyes focus on your breath and be mindful about your body parts about inflow and outflow of the breath and dropping off any thoughts any judgments which are coming towards you and the important aspect here to understand is thoughts are bound to come the more you fight with the thoughts the more they will increase so you need to welcome the thoughts what you resist that persist instead of fighting the thoughts if your thoughts are coming related to your office work then you can have the intention i am welcoming the thoughts related to office work and magically you will see the thoughts will come and pass away like cloud and the thoughts will start reducing so instead of fighting oh i should not think just welcome the thought let it flow off and be aware of the inflow of the and outflow of the breath continuously find out which mindfulness processes works for you and you can practice that and it's not necessary you practice mindfulness with eyes closed only you can do with eyes open while working also while talking to someone also by being totally present in the present moment giving the listening space to a person dropping out all the judgments complaints or criticism related to the situation or a person being mindful accepting the situation as it is without adding any additional meaning so when you sit with eyes closed with focus on your breath and allowing any kind of thoughts come and go out it's training your mind and brain to stop attaching any additional meaning additional compliments any additional judgments all our problems come with expectation and all this additional stuff and it start dropping off things will start opening up by you consistently being in the present moment state now the second type of meditation is the active meditation now what is active meditation that also has many different types like guided meditation visualization based meditation body movement based meditations like osho's dynamic meditation where lot of body movement is involved that's dynamic meditation also there are dancing meditations whichever you resonate choose them i personally love guided meditation and visualization processes where there is some audio that is playing background which guides us through certain visualization processes which guides us through certain awareness and focus practices with this voice along with the music i will be able to easily drift into deeper meditative states because it will help you me to align my mind towards the sound towards the music which makes the meditation practice easier so try different guided meditations and visualization processes in our youtube channel itself we have various guided meditations go through them and you might resonate with one dedicate your life with that one meditation for next 90 days see your life being game changer like i have seen many people in attend my workshops where they learn various healing techniques and processes we as a bonus courses we give some meditation as well and they come back to us and say i did not practice healing techniques much but i made sure to ma- practice this miracle manifestation meditation audio which you gave us every single day and every single day practicing that it helped in manifesting more financial abundance job growth business growth relationship transformation physical health healing and many more benefits so it's all about practicing one thing every single day bruce lee beautifully said i am not afraid of the person 
who knows 10,000 moves and practiced each one of them one time. I'm afraid of the person who practiced one move 10,000 times. So it's all about you sticking with one technique and practicing it again and again, again and again, so that your body gets the mastery towards that particular skill. Set a particular time every single day so that that particular time, no other activities are there, you follow that. And see to fix a particular space also, particular mat if possible, particular chair if possible, so that your brain is trained whenever you go to that place, mat, chair, timing, it's, tuned, it's tuning your entire body to meditate easily, effortlessly. And in the beginning, if you are doing the mindfulness or guided meditation by your own self, visualizing something, you can set a timer. Start with five minutes, then start with six minutes, start with seven minutes, eight minutes, like that. Every single day, you can increment one minute per day. That will help you a lot. Then also, it's good to have a focus object. Like you can be in the meditation by continuous awareness towards your breath, or you can focus towards a candle flame or certain point to allow the focus happen and your mind is going to wander for sure so you should stop judgments and stop hitting oh my god my mind is, mind is wandering again i should stop that stop all that big little voices allow the focus come back towards your breath come back towards that flame or a point dropping off all the judgments i'll welcome that moment of your focus also it's totally fine also, any thoughts that come to you, do not resist as we discussed previously. What you resist that persists. Welcome the thoughts, welcome the distraction. Let it pass through like a cloud. Bring back focus towards your breath, towards a point. Then it will train your mind and brain more and more again and again. Like for an iron piece to transform into magnet, it needs to continuously keep kept on rubbing towards big, big stronger magnet so that all poles of the iron piece are focused towards one direction and transform into magnet. Similarly, you need to train your mind every single day, practice, 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 to gain the mastery or get into the journey towards med meditation. Like there is time, energy and effort that takes to learn cycle, learn driving car or a bike or using a computer. You need to give some time for regular practice of meditation as well to gain mastery towards your mind, brain, body and your life. Congratulations, you have completed the art of practicing meditation. It's all about consistency. Every single day improve by 1%, increase by 1%. By end of one year, you improve by 365%. After every meditation, have a journal if possible and write in the journal what did you feel, what did you experience, what kind of thoughts you get, was it more thoughts or less thoughts, what did you do differently like bringing awareness towards your breath or what technique you practice. When you journal at certain time you can reflect back and understand what's working for you, what's not working for you. Make sure to fix a time and make a habit every single day you practice for some time. As I promised in the beginning of the video, I'll be sharing how you can practice meditation while walking also. There is a breathing technique called 4040 or 5050. When you are walking and with every step as you inhale, count 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 steps done. Then you exhale with 4 count. One, two, three, four, while taking the steps. Step one, inhale, step two, inhale, step three, inhale, step four, inhale. Then step one, exhale, step two, exhale, step three, exhale, step four, exhale. Count this one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, or five, five, or six, six, or seven, seven. And while walking itself, you can train your mind, brain to be focused towards your breath, inflow and outflow, and be totally in the present moment. So this becomes a beautiful walking meditation. I want you to take two minutes time, share in the comments, what is your key takeaway? Which meditation works for you? Is it passive meditation or active meditation? Which do you choose to experiment with? And declare in the comments, what do you want? How do you want to practice meditation? Next seven days at least. Type in the comments, I am up for seven day meditation challenge. Share in the comments, which meditation you are choosing and I will see to personally reply you back and any queries to ask in the comments. 
thank you very much for watching this video i hope this video has been useful to you please share this video to at least one person so that they transform their life with meditation and make the world a better place to live if this video added value to you please hit the subscribe button hit the like icon and bell icon so that you are notified for our future videos thank you very much for watching i look forward to see you in the upcoming videos bye bye take care